welcome back to my channel today we are back on some more roblox today and we are back on bloxburg with another challenge yes you guys enjoy challenges so 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 much and i love them too too so we are back at it again and we are doing the one by one house challenge which is insane like how do you even do this i don't even know uh but irby was like you know what? let's do a challenge and i was like let's do the one by one because it's super hard to do so we're gonna check it out and see if i can actually pull this off i know irby like is way better at building than me so we'll see if i can actually make this happen um but yeah so he's gonna build one at his plot and i'm building one at my plot and then we're gonna see who wins and you guys can vote on the uh, card up there when we uh finish up the builds and stuff like that so yeah let's just get into it so here we are at the plot here that i have um so it's only one by one right so it's not gonna be uh, that big and it's such a small little spot and i just sort of understand how you make it but i sort of don't so we'll see if it actually works and goes the way that i want so first of all I want to add a path, of course. So, not those paths. I don't even know why they have a path thingy. It's so ugly. I mean, you can literally just use the floors for paths. So, I'm just going to make it like so, you know. That can be that. And then I also want to make um, right here so I can make a little garden patch, I guess. Uh, because, you know, the exterior matters as well now because it's just so tiny. You can't do much inside of it. Um, so, yeah. But let's go ahead and change it, this into... Um, some stone not that stone oh no we want like a path stone which is somewhere here i always like mess up there it is okay um do we want to change yes let's just make it a little bit brighter and then this will be a soil of course so i can add some plants on top of it and all that jazz so let's do that i'm not exactly sure what color we're so not color what texture they use i'm not a pro builder if you guys don't know this i am not uh one of those cool people on bloxburg who builds irvy does that so uh i apologize for my stupidity on um what to use and stuff like that so now we're gonna get a fence here and i'm just gonna get one of these normal little fences and make a little plot like so so it's like a um a garden pot plot you know plot pot it's not a pot it's a plot um and then we're gonna paint these um white i guess sure we'll go with a white theme sure okay um so let's just do that i hate how the stuff that you get is grayish and not white i wish it turned white making me spend so much money on coloring up for no reason so we're gonna color all of these here and then we will get to the actual main building here, which I'm super excited about. I don't know how I'm going to pull this off, but we'll see. So first of all, I need to make these walls. It's so tiny. Like, oh my gosh. What even? So I'm going to make it three floors, of course, because Irby has the expansion pack as well. Um, this is not even the Sims. Why am I saying expansion pack? Uh, the game pass for three floors so that's what we're gonna do i'm gonna add a roof really quick as well um what type of roof do i want do i want a cable roof i love my cable roof so we're gonna go with that is that gable not cable oh <laughs> my bad okay we're gonna go to decorate now not decorate let's go ahead and add some doors actually some doors one door not some um i don't know what fits i was seeing a lot of people use a plain door frame and then getting shutters i'm not exactly sure why maybe there's something to it but i don't know what's to it so i'm just gonna use what i want and i'm gonna use a tall glass door because those are super cute so i'm gonna use that hopefully it goes well so i'm gonna change this into white here change this into um do i want black do i want a white what is this oh that's the door handle okay let's make that white then um yeah okay we're gonna do that and i'm gonna hurry up and do some gardening actually so i can get a little feel of it you know um and there we go so now i need to figure out how to do the insides which i don't actually know how to do um but we'll see and we have to paint the walls which i totally forgot about um so it's going to go into floors automatic placement yeah <laughs> it's so tiny um but we also need uh, um uh what you call it the ladders we need ladder because we can't have stairs because it's too tiny for stairs so what do we do with this do we just like attach it to the side i'm guessing that's how we use ladders i don't use ladders i've never even used a ladder maybe i should use ladders to be honest they look pretty cool again why can't i place oh can i only place it like every two floors oh no there's no floor oh <gasps> Oh, that's why. Duh. Okay. <laughs> I'm so stupid. There's no floor there, so of course. Um, Irby logged off for some reason. I don't even know what happened to him. He leaves randomly and just leaves me alone. Oh, 
well, I guess it's not a build off anymore. I guess I'm just going to build myself. So it's just a challenge now, not a build off, which I apologize for. Maybe he'll come back and let me see his one by one build. We'll see. Um, but anyways, I'm going to continue here. Uh, we're just gonna paint some walls. I think I'm gonna do a white and I also repainted these two a black because I think it looks a lot better And so now I want to go into decorate and just place something random like maybe a chair You know like I really need a chair. This only takes like one space like how do I even okay? We can play stuff. Okay, we can play stuff with the ladder, which is fine You know what we're gonna go with this chair because why not like you just walk in and there's a chair like we gotta make use of our space So that's what's gonna happen um, So there we go and we're gonna go into some painting. He says this is gonna be horrible. Mm, I agree, this is gonna be really bad, not gonna lie. Uh, but I can't even, there we go, okay. So that's white. Um, let's make this a black. That's what, what were you? Were you wood? And there we go. So now we have a little one floor. Some paintings, you know, like I am gonna make this so homey. Like you guys don't even know. It's gonna be so cute. So let's go and get a painting here. I'm not sure what size I can actually can't fit that. Okay. Might need to get like a poster. You know those tiny little posters that you can get? Um, let's go ahead and get one of those. Yes, a beautiful. Let's get one for that size. It's gonna be great. Okay, so we have that, and of course we need some lighting um, for each floor. So let's go and do just one simple little um, light. You know, you don't even need that much light anymore because like there's no room for it. Okay, so also when I see um, you have to add a floor before you can add things, and then you just delete the floor to be honest, so you can actually go upstairs. So we're gonna see how this works. I don't know if this is gonna be functional after I'm done, but we'll see. So let's go ahead and add a floor here. And then what you do is add something and then you just delete the floor basically. Um, I don't know how you're going to get up there because it's blocking you. Don't really know. Maybe you can add a chair and then you sit on it and you go up. That's, oh my gosh, I think that's what you do. So I have to move the chair from the first floor to the second floor. I can't go up. I can't do this. Oh wait, I forgot that he added this. <gasps> I forgot the build, I mean not the builder. The owner added the space bar thing so you can look. There we go. Okay, so now I can get up to the second floor when I need to. I don't know why I needed the ladder then. Do I even need the ladder? I don't know, maybe for the third floor I need the ladder. Not for, yeah, because if I if I go up, you can just sit. <gasps> yes, I don't need the ladder for that one. Okay, so we'll put that in the third floor. I can't add a bed either, so it's not gonna be like, you know, a functional, functional place, um, but we'll see. So let's go ahead and grab something from the kitchen. I mean, we could literally put a stove, a stove, you know, we could put a stove in it. It'll be wonderful. I mean, can I add a cabinet? I don't know, but let's go ahead and add, okay, there we go. <sighs> Gosh. Okay, we're gonna go to small actually. I think that's gonna help us a little bit. There we go. Maybe if I add a shelf Ooh. Okay, let's go add a shelf and then let's see if I can put stuff on there because I can add um, A lot more stuff. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, there we go And then let's go back to the kitchen here where I can add a toaster. Yes, look at me adding all the stuff here. So we can add a toaster here. Um, and then we can also add a blender. You know, we gotta blend those smoothies up. Um, let's go ahead and paint this stuff as well. The thing is, I don't have a fridge, uh, but there are these mini fridges. But in, <gasps> I can fit them in. This is gonna be like the most, like it's gonna be, oh, I can store so much stuff in here, wait. Can I put this on? Oh, I can put this on top of here. Okay, wait. This is gonna be a, such a compact place, but like, I mean, it's a one by one. Can I like put stuff outwards? I'm just gonna do it. If it's against the rules, I apologize. <laughs> it's so cute though. Like it's literally a whole kitchen. It's amazing. Okay, I'm just gonna move this a little bit down here. We'll put some recipes or something there. Okay, so I added a floor. I added the uh, ladder for that because I do think it can just go on top of the uh, the couch thingy. So let's go back to part two. Part two. Why do I keep saying part two? Floor two. And see if I can add some more things. I'm not sure what I can add, to be honest, because I don't think a TV is going to fit. But we'll, we'll, we'll take a see look, you know, we'll take a peek. Okay, so instead of adding a TV, because I don't really think I can do that, um, I'm going to add a shelf and put books in it, because, you know, we got to read. Reading is good for you, so that's what we're going to do. Um, and I also changed up the colors and stuff like that. added some more things out here as well. Um, I'll give you a grand tour afterwards, but I'm going to go ahead and add a bookshelf over here. And then let's go ahead and get some uh, books. Um, let's get these and then we'll just place them right here. Yeah, it's looking great. Let's go ahead and, and you know for a little bit of sprucing up Let's go ahead and add our favorite little plants here You know like look how cute this cute little place is gonna be now Actually, I did not need the ladder for the third floor. I actually need the ladder for the second floor So I'm gonna go ahead and take this ladder 
and put it in the second floor over here um, because that's where I needed it. But of course, I don't have a floor anymore because I don't. Okay, there we go. So now I have a ladder up there. Um, so now on the third floor, what did I say that I wanted to do? Oh yeah, the bathroom. Okay, so let's do the bathroom up here, which we just need a... We do need a sink. Who needs a sink? Whole, we can just go outside and wash our hands, you know? I mean, in the kitchen, you know? We can go there. We don't have a sink there either. You know, it's fine. I'll just use some ice cubes. Um, that's really gross, though. Oh, what did I just even say? I don't even mind what I just said, but... We're so there we go i think this is our one by one house and actually one second i need to add some trees back here so people don't see how that mini fridge is popping out of there so i'm gonna add um there we go let's just add one of these trees really quick so no one sees that yep no th nothing's popping out it's okay it's all good so here is the one by one house and let's go take a tour okay no wonder people were saying this is a hard challenge because it totally is like i seriously can't get to the second floor um which is a problem because it keeps glitching me back to the first floor after i do that but we're gonna switch the living room and the bathroom and see if that helps because i can actually get up from the ladder then see now i should be able to get up here and then over here i can just like you know do the the thingy that you just you know hop up on the seat and you'll get there so I'm gonna try this and hopefully it works. I mean, I hope so, you know, I mean, this is very stressful. Okay, now let's see if it works. Hopefully it works. Um, so there we go. Oh my gosh, yes, yes, so now we can go to the bathroom and then um, to get to the reading room, all you do is do that. Look at that, oh my gosh, I did it. I did it, you guys. But I'm having some issues coming down though. Um. Oh, there we go. I got it. Okay. Um, yes, you guys can come see. Come, come look. Come look, my people. How will you cook without uh, uh, the fridge? I got a mini fridge. I got a mini fridge. Can I cook with this? See, look. I, I'm literally gonna cook them something. Uh, wait, I don't have a counter. Oh, no. I don't have a counter. Oh, no. I don't have a counter. Okay, I don't have a counter to cook, which is sad, um, but I think I can, you know, make a smoothie. Let's just make a smoothie, because why not? Uh, but that's a bummer that I don't have a counter. I totally forgot. Shut up, Thunder. I totally forgot that we needed a counter, but I got myself a milkshake. Like, what more do you need? You don't need real food. I got milkshakes. To I'm saying yeah, that's basically one by one challenge. It was quite hard not gonna lie um let me just you know make myself better uh but it was it was super hard like i was i was like how do i do this like i knew like how to make it but i didn't know how to like get to the next floor so that's the problem i had but here we are doing a little house tour of my one by one so we got some pads here we got some nice i really like it, it looks kind of cute um but here we are we got a mini fridge we got a toaster we got a blender we do need a counter but like we don't we don't need it um and we also got a stove and our a cute little door here and um let me actually close the door can i not okay some people are stuck in here okay you're stuck um it does take a little bit to um get out of here because it's quite difficult but let me help you out there so there we go so we go here um you close the door then you can go up here um and then you can use the bathroom and then you can wash your hands you know after you use the bathroom it's like i'm in the toilet but that's okay we also got some toilet paper got you covered you know um you can look outside while you do that and then all you do is look up um and then uh sit and there you go you have your little reading nook you know in the dark um but you can look out and um you know read your book and have some good time so that's basically the whole place and then when you get out you just uh you hop back into the second floor and then you just gotta, you know, you're mosey your way down to the first floor. It's kind of difficult to get back on the first floor, but I did it. I did it once, uh, but I'm just gonna go to Ender Build Mode because it's much easier. And yeah, that's basically that. I'm gonna throw a party and see if anyone, you know, reacts to it or something. Uh, but that's basically the one by one house challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was, uh, I took a quite long time of building this. I'm not gonna lie, for a one by one, it took super long. Um, but yeah hope you enjoyed i'm sorry if irby couldn't make it here i don't know where he is i don't know where he went uh, he hasn't responded back which is quite sad but it's okay and this thunder is gonna go wild but i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did don't forget to leave a like i just hit the mic oh don't forget to leave a like down below subscribe if you guys are new turn the notification bell on as well so you guys know when i upload every single day and yeah that's it i think yeah that's it so i hope you guys enjoy i'll see you guys tomorrow bye bye